Welcome back to Ravenfield. This is the map Archipelago, and it is my absolute favorite, at least official map in Ravenfield. And for a number of reasons, as we approach the carrier, you just see this amazing weapon of war and all of the little blue guys are coming out to man the anti-aircraft guns to get on some Zodiac boats. And I don't know, maybe run over their friends, but that's neither here nor there. And then get in the helicopters and in the aircraft and invade the island where the Raven team, it's interesting. The game's called Ravenfield, and the red is Raven, and, and the blue's Eagle, right? So, and the blue's the good guys, right? Anyway, and then you attack the island, and it's like, that's kind of your objective. Take these zones, take the island, right? It's amazing. It's just such a good map, and I'd love to see a lot more done to it, but that is a discussion for another video. But wouldn't it be amazing if not only did you have to take the island to win the game, but you had to take the island to protect your aircraft carrier, because on the island is a nuclear ballistic missile that wants nothing more than to blow up your beautiful and impressive aircraft carrier base. Well, guess what? Today we're gonna do just that. So essentially what happens on this map, let's take a quick look. Oh, it looks like red is controlling it. We're gonna have to change that up so that both teams are gonna start on the enemy carriers and then attack it. But essentially this remote Arctic outpost in the middle of who knows where is pretty well defended for a seemingly, you know, innocuous little barren rock in a very inhospitable area of the world. But then you see the giant radar dish and you may be asking yourself, hey, Baron, you think there's a giant ballistic missile buried on this island that whoever occupies the island for five minutes is then able to launch that ballistic missile at the enemy's carrier? Because guess what? Both teams start with them and look at this. These are very modern. Now, I want to say a big shout out to the man, the myth, the legend who made this map possible. Sofa used to be known as the fifth smell and we all know him as one of the best. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Hello, boy. Boys, welcome to the war. One of the best map makers, and because not only does he make great maps, but he, he pushes the game to its limits and really opens up our imagination. And look at the Vanilla Plus, baby. Vanilla Plus is awesome. These weapon systems are looking pretty juicy. So what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be jumping in. I wonder where the missile launches from. I'm kind of curious. And by kind of, I mean, I'm insatiably curious on where the missile gets launched from. But we're gonna take part. We're gonna try to take the island and hold it for five minutes. And look at this, intense aerial barrage. So without further ado, let's jump into the action. So we're gonna play as the Eagle faction. And some of the notable things are there's a 15 second respawn time and only 50 bots are recommended. And there's two maps, Countdown and Arctic Island. The Countdown one is obviously the one with the missile countdown. You can see the thumbnail, that missile goes boom. So let's do a little quick of a configuration of the flags so that we can get this right. Okay, so the launch site is in the middle. No, you're not gonna launch in five minutes because no one occupies the island. So flags have been configured, red and blue. Eagle and Raven are gonna be fighting over this. Now, remember that we've got the vanilla plus weapon, so let's, we're Eagle, so let's make sure we have Eagle-based weaponry. I'm gonna use this. This looks pretty juicy. The revolver looks pretty beast. And the poltergeist a AMR looks like it can take down vehicles. I'm gonna take the wrench this time. I'm gonna take that radar dish. So here we go. Ooh, the vanilla plus helicopters look gorgeous. The fighters are there. I'm thinking what I'm gonna wanna do is pilot one of these helicopters and make it over there. Jets are gonna take off. I'm gonna let the AI cover us, right? That, that sounds pretty good. Gentlemen, start your engines. All right, boys, pack your bags. We're going to war. Now, I'm your pilot, and as we all know, if you've ever watched me play Ravenfield before, you know, sometimes, sometimes it's good, sometimes it's maybe, maybe not so good in terms of my piloting skills. But my objective isn't to <laughs> what I'm really tempted to do, which is to go immediately for the radar station. I want to make sure we get a beachhead because we're the point helicopter here. We're out there front. So, oh, one of those pilots did a very ballsy evasive maneuver and flew into the water. He may have flown out, but you know what? Not a big deal. We didn't see it. All right, yeah, so there's a capture point on the coast. Ooh, enemy fighters around here. Kind of scary. Uh, is someone trying to lock onto me? I mean, they definitely are. Mini guns are firing. Okay, we're gonna start descending and I'm gonna be looking for this flag. All right, the flag. Okay, I see it. It's off my left side. All right, boys, I'm gonna try to do this. Everybody get out. Everybody get out. All right, get the frick out of this helicopter and attack the east beach because after that we're gonna move up oh they, they parachuted out that was pretty cool wait is that an enemy helicopter there is a red helicopter over here however so we've got these armor piercing rounds right we made contact all right we've captured this point and i'm gonna take down that helicopter this is, i missed it's the last thing i do oh oh look at this all right boys let's get in this little machine gun jeep and make our way up all aboard dude this is awesome oh my goodness are we taking 
fucking enemy. Fire! Yes, we are. But here's the good thing, okay? We've captured... Wait a minute. They've captured a better point. Dang it. Here I am thinking we did good. We must do better. No, 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 no. Oh, oh. Okay. Missile launch in two minutes. Okay. This fighter is eating my face. Oh, missile launch in five minutes. We've taken it. Okay, good, good, good. And now we can actually respawn there. I'm gonna pick... Do we have a light MG by chance? Yes, we do. Okay. I'm gonna deploy up there on the radar dish. All right, light... Oh my God, look at this. We even got this little like mobile radar thing. Then the big one. Oh, and we helicopter hovering. There we go. That's a hit. Another hit. Ow, 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 ow. Guys, cover. Cover me. <laughs> Classic team game where I'm like, guys, you need to cover me, okay? I'm the protagonist. There we go. Taken down. I'm at 19 health. So wait, there's red boys over here? Oh, man, this is a really nice MG. Red's just coming over that hill, and I'm just chewing them up. Still got 42 rounds in my belt. Medic! Medic! Ooh, I think I see medicine. Hold on, boys. I'm going to run across the battlefield and make myself vulnerable to try to heal myself so I'm less vulnerable. And that's called science. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's dangerous. Oh, God, that's bad. I'm dead. <laughs> Collapse. Indeed. Our defense is collapsing. Ooh, three minutes, boys. Three minutes. We gotta hold. Hold the line. Wow, they've taken both the landing sites, actually. Holy biscuits. Oh, I hear something. Yes, good shot. Raven captured the bridge. We just have to hold this. This is like the key spot. So it's kind of cool in that there's a greater emphasis in this map on different capture points, right? Obviously, one is significantly uh, more important than the rest of them. Although you don't want to lose your carry because that's where your Air Force is. Once the nuke goes off, that's exactly what's going to happen to them. Red oh, technically fuck. holds the beach down there. <laughs> you see? Oh, we just fired the missile and took out that helicopter. Oh, oh, oh that's, that's red, guys. All right. My boy Hypercore just got taken down. Oh, 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 dang, I just got shot up. Medic, hold the point. All right, you know what? Actually, we are going to make it clear that we need to hold this point. I'm going to put the shield there. Greater emphasis is going to be on it. So I, I just don't see a missile sight. I'm wondering, do you think it like pops up? Is it is it camouflaged with snow or does it pop up like over? Wait, did it say 15 seconds? Oh, I'm, I do not want to miss this. Oh, oh my God. It's getting a little bit kind of ridiculous. I have 16 health. We're losing the flag? Are you serious? Who did it? That That's just depressing. Where Where are they? Missile launch in five minutes. You gotta be kidding me. Guys, defend the freaking flag. <laughs> I blame them, but I mean, I'm part of the problem too here, clearly. Oh my god, who just shot that thing? Hey! hey, hey. Goodbye, boys! Let's see if I can't hit that guy. Nope. <laughs> the answer's no. So you see how difficult this is to hold it when everyone's going for it. Ooh. Oh god. I need a better anti-armor gun. These anti-tank rounds don't seem to be cutting it. Okay, what do we have on our arsenal for Eagle? ATD-80? That sounds good. All right, they're rocking in with their armored vehicles. I should have one as well. Now, is that our carry over there? Yes, it is. So that's those are friendly helicopters. Oh! All right, boys, let's take this island. I clearly need a tank. Oh, here we go. Jeep's better than nothing. All right, boys, take that Jeep and go take the top. Don't run me over. Wait a minute. That is an enemy helicopter. Can I lock on this? No. Ooh, we hold it. I just feel like I should have armor down here. Oh, snap. Oh, they're coming. Oh, the plane just flew overhead. And I shot the two guys that were bum rushing this flag. This is mine. Yeah, you gotta remember when there's only 50 versus 50, or rather 25 versus 25, there's there's not a lot of guys in one place at a, at a general time. Missile launch launching four minutes. I'm still waiting on this tank. Dang. I love the plane crashing. Oh, man. I think our armor is just alive up there. So I'm gonna hop, hoof it up there. And the aircraft's going, doing work though. I'm just spraying these dudes, hoping to hit one or two of them. I definitely weaken them. Oh, another enemy helicopter. They're, I think they just dropped smoke grenade and did like a commando attack here. Oh, oh snap, dog fighting's going on. Like, it, it's absolutely hectic. Okay, to keep me alive, I'm gonna have to commandeer this vehicle that's dead. Dang it. I have a wrench. Can we fix it? <laughs> it won't fix. Two minutes. We're getting back there. And we have a, a much better defense here now that everybody's participating. Red's trying to make it up here. They get chewed down, get caught in a crossfire, and then they just bum rush us in the back. It was a feint. They're using some next level tactics. Oops, sorry. Dang, I'm down to low rounds. I need ammunition and supplies. Ooh, that was a... That was a rocket. Look at this. Everybody's just chilling here. Guys, uh, what about the other side? I guess that's the only one they're on. So you see that carrier over there? That carrier is going to get nuked or hit by, I don't know, a tomahawk. Okay, all we got to do is not mess up again, which shouldn't be too hard. Although it looks like Red is capturing that base over there. I'm going to try to shell this helicopter. 
Now he's elevating. Oh, alarm bells. Oh man, of course they're gonna parachute right now. Watch. No? Okay, there's two of them. Oh, do you see that? We're getting blinded by the light. Ah. All right, so that missile just went up. And don't worry, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see this in spectator mode too. Okay, now will we see the missile? Oh my God, that's like intercontinental style. So then that carry over there is the one that's gonna get hit. Oh, oh snap. Carrie just got nuked, boys. That was glorious. Oh my God. Okay, so then can they spawn over there? I don't know, actually. Oh wow, they're all over there. I don't think they can spawn over there. Now we got this like shootout with these guys because I'm not seeing any vehicles come from that ship anymore. I think they lost it. And I don't think I can change sides in the middle of the game, unfortunately. Well, I mean, isn't that amazing? Like that's something that's not in vanilla Ravenfield. And it's in this one. All right, so this time we're gonna do a spectator. And you know what, just to skew things a little bit, I kind of want to see what it looks like. Give blue that sight. So blue's gonna spawn up here. But here we go, blue's out here defending. That is red. Okay, so that's the carrier that should get nuked if things follow the script. But I want to get a much better viewpoint of the nuke launching out. Now, the story goes, this fridged little rock may not look like much, populated only by a radar station and a variety of seabirds, but it lies disturbingly close to crucial Federation Arctic oil infrastructure and one of the region's only warm water ports. Okay, here's the helicopter helicopter fleet invading four minutes this has made it prime real estate for a hastily established union missile facility fnv sparta has been dispatched to do secure the island while reinforcements and naval air assets launch from uns aldebaran in support of the island's defenses this is a prototype of for a countdown map and countdown teams must secure and hold the missile launch site after five consecutive missile uh, minutes a missile is launched at the other team's carrier that is awesome so this is this is red's invasion currently someone shoot that thing down blue did not bother with ca capturing the anti-aircraft they all like to they seem to really love just occupying those rocks but red red is gonna capture the beach man and after they do and I, one of the things i love is a little clock for a countdown and who oh <laughs> That pilot is dead. Yeah, so once like three minutes. They capture that, then they get armor, and then they can push up. All these little machine gunners just blah, 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 with their little battle rifles. Okay, blue is capturing this, it looks like. Now are you gonna land and drop men off? W what if guys could repel down? Uh-oh, uh-oh. Please be careful where you're landing! Boys, watch out! Oh, <laughs> oh they all got in, okay, cool. Just Ravenfield things. But I love this, man. The beach, like the defense against the beach, it's like, it's very humble, you know what I mean? It's just a bunch of dudes with guns. No formalized bunkers or static defenses. Two minutes. Here we go. Blue's invading properly this time. And here's where all the red guys are. Clustered up, getting shellacked. They kind of seem like the Russians, you know? It's like Russians versus the European Union, maybe. You could imagine are, are like what is representative of each side. The only thing I think I would change... Whoa. Uh, <laughs> sir, are you doing okay? Is having like an actual proper missile silo. But then again, like when you think about what's being done here, once again, Sofa's kind of like, hey, Ravenfield's cool. But watch this. I'm gonna make it even better. Ooh, boy. 15 seconds. See, a countdown, like a timer, would make this so dramatic. I hope Steel Raven sees this and is like, ah, oh, this is this is an amazing idea. I mean, Ravenfield has sold um, over a million copies on Steam, I believe. That's pretty awesome. 30 seconds. This is awesome. Anti-aircraft rounds just shelling the fighter planes as they fly by to give air support or go on a strike mission. But we can't let that... Oh, here we go. The alarm's going off. It's happening. Where does it fire from? Oh, it fires from... It's like a Scud missile launcher. That's awesome. Look at the doors opening. And... Oh! Okay, now let's get in a position because now it's going to strike here. Now, where do we want to be? I think we can see the island in the background. I think this is a pretty decent shot. A missile flying super fast, right? I just wish we could increase, like, the render distance like you can in minecraft oh oh the nuke went off behind us and you can hear your little tachometer like uh, radiation oh man this is this is good and then they can no longer get on the carrier i think if you spawn you die i think that's what what's being illustrated to us very very interesting mechanic Guys, this is Countdown, and it is probably one of the best maps I've seen. And look at this. The missile's fired, and the battle can still go on. But it's like if Red can't spawn in there, like, it's pretty much over, right? So anyway, thank you for watching another episode of Ravenfield. Pull the trigger on the like button if you did enjoy the video. Uh, check the Steam Workshop for this map made by Sofa and the Vanilla Plus uh, mod packs that the community has made. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.